We hope you're enjoying the show at home. Plenty of top class entertainment coming your way. Performing right there live for you very, very soon. Now, every year you know we have some incredible challenges going on. Hamish has got something special for us this year, right, mate? I do, Larry. I do. Uh, Jalen Yogurt is a big supporter of the Royal Children's Hospital. And every year they give $20,000. And they say, you choose what you'd like some of your people to do. So Wayne Carey, he's new to the football team. Andrew Wells, second year. Sammy Lane, a star. And Matthew Richardson just loves doing things because he's a big uh, supporter of the Royal Children's Hospital. I'll get to why they ended up in a dragon boat during the week, but in the lead-up to the Good Friday appeal, they decided they would race against the Melbourne Flames, who are Victoria's state champions for dragon boat racing. They had no idea what they were doing. This is sort of how it went. You're going to get two very important commands. One is brace. Brace is paddles out flat on top of the water, skimming the water. That's bracing, so if there's any chops or anything like that, we have like two big outriggers on the side. The harder you lead, the quicker we stop. Emergency stop. As soon as we get in the boat, you're going to number off. So we number off from the drummer down to how many people in, in the boat. In the case of a capsize, <laughs> right? In the case of no a capsize, capsize. you fall to... in, <laughs> pull your toggles. <laughs> it's a tough task, John. <laughs> Richo, very good at the MCG. Spent a lot of time on the Yarra, have you? Uh, yeah, I did once at Bathtub Rally. I went in and I swallowed a heap of water and was cooked for about a week. You should be fine. Duck Pakin's paddock was uh, how you operated on the G. What's the sort of program today? Um, program? Stay I can in the tell boat. you this. Andrew Welsh takes his dragon boat racing very seriously. That wasn't on yesterday. He's put that on just for the race. Who do you feel more comfortable with, Welsh, Kerry or Richardson? Um, <laughs> the dragon boat tattoo's got me, so Welsh. <laughs> OK, well, Sorry, take sure. <laughs> Well, Adrian, it's a perfect time to be on the Arrow, but the Police and Emergency Games are launched on Friday. Yep. Tell us about them. Yeah, the Australasian Police and Emergency Services Games. Three and a half thousand competitors from all around Australia and New Zealand, including 20 from Papua New Guinea. And tell us today, who have we got in the boats? I know that Kerry, Welsh, Richardson and Elaine are with one boat, and who's the other? Yeah, we've got three members from our water police and one, mem one member from the Ambulance Victoria. The guys in yellow, the Tour de France leaders, are they sort of more experienced than you? extremely much more experienced than we are. Um, they do this all the time. Right, they've started the emergency services versus the AFL. And $20,000 thanks to Jelny Yogurt being donated to the winning team who donate to the Royal Children's. But Kerry at half back, Welsh at half forward, Sammy Jane Lane in the forward pocket. How are you travelling, Richo? Oh, Richo wants to be subbed out. Look at Richo. Richo's battling. He's, uh, he's had a long lunch and he's now starting to really suck it in. Have a look, they're trying to go to the beat of the drum. So Richo and the boys have got a good start. The drama is these guys have got a full complement of state champions. They're some of the best in the land. Have a look at this crew. You've got them by a length and a half and you're flying, lads, flying! These guys are sitting in the wake. These guys have got, I reckon, a length and a half. We've got 200 to run. They're gaining quickly. Richo's starting to tire. Duck, I tell you what, this is actually going to be a close run thing. Get out of the wake! Get out of the wake! The finish line is that far pier down there. They've got about a length and a half. And they've got drop back in the wake. But these guys, we're about to hit them. We won't say anything. But this is the finish line over here. They're not going to get there. Richo's going to win a grand final. Duck's going to win his third. Welsh is a part of all. And Sam will write about this, but how good is it? Johnny Yoga, $20,000 to the winning crew. I declare the AFL boats the champions of the river. It was like something out of sort of